Great Plains of the United States call to mind images of wheat fields, cowboys, cattle, and oil, only a part of the reality for the small town of Enid, Oklahoma. For 55 years, Vance Air Force Base has represented the best cooperative efforts between the United States Air Force and Enid, Oklahoma. Vance is located about five miles south of downtown Enid on land which once produced bumper wheat crops. In 1941, for the price of one dollar a year, this land was leased from the city by the federal government as a site for a pilot training field. The mission of the school was to train aviation cadets to become aircraft pilots and commissioned officers in the Army Air Corps. In keeping with the Air Force tradition of naming bases for deceased Air Force flyers, the base was renamed after a local World War II hero and Medal of Honor winner, Lieutenant Colonel Leon Robert Vance, Jr. It has grown to be the finest and most efficient undergraduate pilot training base in the Air Force. For the 5,283 military members, their families, retirees, DOD civilians, and private contractors, Vance Air Force Base remains one of the top bases in the Air Education and Training Command. The twin-engine T-37, designed as a primary trainer, became operational at the base in 1961. The T-33 was replaced in 1963 and 64 by the T-38, an advanced supersonic jet trainer. The T-37 and the T-38 are still used for pilot training advanced today. In 1960, Vance was selected by the Air Force as part of an extended experiment in contract services. Under this plan, a civilian contractor furnishes the support facilities normally provided by the base agencies, including aircraft and base maintenance, ground transportation, fire protection, procurement, supply, photographic support, and other services. All military training continues, however, under military supervision. In 1995, the 71st Flying Training Wing moved into a specialized undergraduate pilot training program with the arrival of the T-1. Joint training with the Navy became a reality in March 1996 when a Navy commander assumed command of the 8th Flying Training Squadron. Navy and Marine Corps student pilots arrived in April 1996 as part of the Class 9708. Pilots trained at Vance have seen combat in World War II, Korea, Vietnam, and most recently, the Middle East with Desert Storm. The community's high regard for the base is demonstrated by signs along the highways which read, Vance Air Force Base, Pride of Enid, Oklahoma, Pride of America. You could arrive at Woodring Airport in Enid if you are able to land in Dallas and arrange flight connections with Lone Star Airlines for the final part of your trip. If you're traveling by car, all highways are well marked. The main gate is on the newly named Pride Drive, just off U.S. Highway 81. The security police at the main gate will issue you a visitor's pass for your vehicle if you don't already have a sticker. You'll be directed to Base Billeting, Building 714 to check in. The lodging office is the 24-hour central arrival point where newcomers can obtain information on temporary housing and contact their sponsor. All vehicles owned by military members, family members, and civilian employees assigned to Vance must be registered with the 71st Security Police Squadron Pass and Registration Section within three days of arrival. The 71st Security Police Squadron has the overall responsibility for base security and law enforcement. The desk sergeant will assist you in any emergency or answer any question concerning SP activities. Vance has two gates for your use. The main gate, known as Hairston Gate, is open 24 hours a day. The west gate, or the back gate, is open Monday through Friday from 0500 to 1800 hours, except Saturdays, Sundays, and holidays. Permanent party and enlisted personnel are housed in well-kept air-conditioned dormitories. Vance has two three-story enlisted dorms. Enlisted personnel will be assigned semi-private rooms with a shared bathroom. Single officers living on base are housed in modern unaccompanied officer personnel housing units. Each unit is equipped with a kitchen, bathroom, and private outside entrance. Laundry rooms are located in each building. Vance's family housing area is the pride of Vance Air Force Base. They've received the highest possible rating five times in a row from the Air Education and Training Command Inspector General Team. 
Married couples, both officer and enlisted, live in 230 modern single unit or duplex quarters of K-part style. Each unit is equipped with a stove, refrigerator, dishwasher, indoor utility room, heating and air conditioning, patio and sliding glass door, outdoor utility room, carport, and an attic storage area above the carport. Newcomers can enter their name on a waiting list for on-base housing while at their old duty station. Simply file Form 1746 with your old military family housing office. The 71st Flying Training Wing conducts undergraduate pilot training for qualified U.S. Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps officers and international officers. Flying training is also provided for members of the Air National Guard and the Air Force Reserves. Approximately 250 pilots graduate annually from Vance. The mission of the 71st Operations Group is to safely conduct quality flying training for the U.S. military and international student pilots and their gaining commands. Four squadrons comprise the operations function. The 8th Flying Training Squadron, which trains students in the T-37, the 25th Flying Training Squadron, the T-38 Squadron, the 32nd Flying Training Squadron, the T-1 Squadron, and the 71st Operations Support Squadron. Flight training airspace is controlled by highly qualified military air traffic controllers and experienced contract flight simulator instructors supplement flight training using aircraft simulation with motion and visual capabilities. The other essential element, maintenance, also falls under the operations group umbrella. Contract maintenance support keeps the Vance fleet of 206 T-37 Tweet, T-38 Talons, and the T-1 Jayhawk aircraft in top quality flying condition. The 71st Operation Support Squadron complements the specialized undergraduate pilot training mission by providing academic training, air traffic control, weather, and quality assurance oversight of airfield management and base operations. The 71st Support Group provides quality base support and services to the wing. The group's four squadrons support the undergraduate pilot training mission and provide critical base functions. The 71st Mission Support Squadron conducts wing-wide programs encompassing military and civilian personnel, administration, education, military training, and services specific to families for the 2,400 personnel assigned or attached to Vance. The 71st Logistics Squadron's mission is to provide quality fuel, equipment, supplies, transportation, and civil engineering support to all assigned personnel. The Logistics Squadron also manages services, all personnel quarters, base recreational activities, and the base stock fund account. The 71st Communications Squadron supports the undergraduate pilot training program of the 71st Flying Training Wing by maintaining air traffic control, communications computer systems, and meteorological equipment at Vance and Kegelman Auxiliary Field near Jet, Oklahoma. Installation security and law enforcement operations for Vance and Kegelman Auxiliary Field are the responsibility of the 71st Security Police Squadron. Operations include administration, resource protection, crime protection, crime prevention, and combat arms training for base personnel. Since 1960, nearly 80% of the base support services have been provided by a civilian contractor. Vance is the only one of four UPT bases to operate under an umbrella-type contract. Northrop Worldwide Aircraft Services, Incorporated has been providing those services since 1972 and is responsible for aircraft maintenance, civil engineering, supply and transportation, services, recreation facilities and activities, and airfield management. McDonnell Douglas provides aircraft simulator support for Vance and UNC Aviation Services oversees the simulator and academic training for the T-37 and T-38. The 71st Medical Group Clinic provides outpatient medical services including flight medicine, primary care, the aerospace physiology unit, the wellness center, and preventative health services, optometry, mental health, and dental. Additional services are available at the clinic through the partnership program which includes general medicine and pediatrics. The dental clinic is located near the clinic's main entrance and provides complete preventative and therapeutic care for military personnel. Children between the ages of 1 and 10 years are cared for by professionally trained employees dedicated to a safe, educational and caring environment.
A beautiful new building with a built-in gym houses Vance's Youth Center, providing a variety of well-supervised fun activities is the goal of the dedicated staff. Games, pool tables, TV, music, crafts, computers, gym activities, and special events promote new skills and positive socializing for children and teens ages 5 to 17 and 18 if still in high school. The Family Support Center exists to address and respond to family issues impacting the Air Force mission. Services are available to active duty Air Force personnel and their families, Air Force retirees, and Department of Defense civilian employees attached to Vance. Center services include information and referral assistance, transition assistance, relocation assistance, support during duty separation, family financial management, education, employment assistance, volunteer resource program, family development education, Air Force Aid Society, and family services. Family services goal is to provide assistance to military families at Vance. One of its services is a loan closet with items such as futons, sheets, blankets, dishes, irons, high chairs, playpens, and much more offered at no charge. Base exchange facilities offer a wide variety of services to patrons. The main exchange, class 6 store, military clothing, shop vet, garden shop, barber shop, and optical shop are all consolidated in the exchange complex. Vance's Commissary is a modern, well-stocked store offering the convenience of a supermarket and a delicatessen. Vancello's Restaurant, formerly the NCO Club, caters to all Vance members, providing sit-down, carry-out, and delivery dining services. The restaurant serves a variety of food, including pizza, pasta, subs, and salads. Tickets for local activities and theme parks are located at the cashier counter. The Crazy Horse Lounge, which caters to enlisted members, provides services to include a fully stocked bar. Other services include a private party area, professional entertainment, widescreen TV, bingo, dancing, and a patio. The Vance Club, formerly the Officers Club, provides breakfast and lunch daily, with dinner in the dining room on Fridays and Saturdays only. The Cockpit, an adjoining bar, provides a relaxed atmosphere with its crud table, dancing, and frequent live entertainment. Special functions and catering are available upon request. Central National Bank, centrally located on base, offers many services, including an automatic teller machine, providing 24-hour services with a $995 maximum withdrawal per day, Visa and MasterCard credit cards, and traditional savings and checking accounts. Membership at Tinker Credit Union is open to all personnel and family members assigned to Vance. The credit union features share accounts, individual retirement accounts, credit cards, and low-interest loans. The Education Services Office provides educational counseling and advice to military members and their families. Graduate, undergraduate, and vocational classes are available to Vance members in the local area. Several institutions provide Vance personnel providing full degrees as well as vocational training. Vance chaplains invite you to make the base chapel your church home. Here you will find a warm, caring group of people who will welcome you into our family. Our chapel community is focused on the twin goals of spiritual growth and community service. The Thrift Shop is a second-hand shop which is operated by volunteers and managed by the Officers Spouses Club, but it is open to all personnel. It offers low prices on clothing, furniture, uniforms, appliances, toys, and other items. Articles can be donated to the shop or placed on consignment. Keeping Vance people and the citizens in the community informed of happenings on base and throughout the Air Force is the primary mission of Wing Public Affairs. The PA staff produces a weekly newspaper, The Air Scoop. They also produce fact sheets, commander's biographies, monthly commander's call topics, the Vance Report, Vance Vision, Vance Briefs, base visitor tours, and all official news releases. The Bradley Gymnasium is the focal point of Vance's athletic and intramural programs and fitness training. Weekdays, an average of 300 people find health, fitness, and fun using the cardiovascular room and weight rooms, Nautilus and free weights, basketball courts, saunas, women's workout room, and the racquetball courts. In addition to the indoor gym facilities, the base also has lighted tennis courts and all-purpose courts near the gym. For the joggers and runners, Vance has a tartan surface track and user-controlled lights for year-round use. 
lighted baseball fields and an intramural football field are also located on base. In addition, there are also two mini rollerblade hockey courts. A new fitness evaluation center rounds out the gym facilities and services. Keglers of all ages enjoy a long list of advantages at Vance's Bowling Center. Bargain prices on eight lanes, free lessons by appointment, and state-of-the-art equipment make this facility easy on the budget. Intermural, league, and tournament bowling, in addition to children's bumper bowling and birthday parties, provide fun for the entire family. Authorized personnel may rent a variety of recreational equipment ranging from campers to lawnmowers. Fishing, hunting, camping, gardening, and golf equipment, as well as video games, VCRs, and camcorders are available at nominal prices. Pop-up trailers and five-person, 15-foot self-contained camping trailers, pontoon bass, and ski boats are also available for rental. Dusty volumes tended by tiny women whispering shh does not depict Vance's award-winning library. 16,000 books and magazines is where the similarity ends. Books and music, including country western, rock and classical are offered in record cassette and compact disc format. Nearly 1,200 video cassettes form a collection of current, educational, classic, and children titles. These may be checked out at little or no charge. IBM-compatible computers, complete with software, tutorial programs, and printers, may be used by patrons. Handcraftsmen of centuries past rarely suffered from the stress-related maladies so common in today's high-strung society. The Vance Skills Development Center provides a relaxing and fruitful diversion to a hectic day by offering a well-equipped facility. Classes in woodworking and fine arts are advertised in monthly bulletins and special flyers. All vehicles, regardless of age, national origin, fuel preference, or physical disability, are eligible to use the 8 indoor and 19 outdoor work stalls at the Auto Skills Center. Knowledgeable instructor mechanics are happy to assist you in servicing your vehicle or instructing you in the operation of the shop state-of-the-art tools and equipment. Classes are offered with topics covering tune-ups, brakes, welding, preventative maintenance, and engine overhauls. All year round, base sod busters are invited to use the lighted golf driving range. The range includes a sand trap, buckets of low-cost practice balls, and even a barbecue and picnic area. It provides hours of outdoor fun. Hot Oklahoma days make the base pools a welcome relief from Memorial Day through Labor Day. Two pools are located on base, one next to the Vans Club and one next to the Bradley Gymnasium. Vance's relationship with its host community Enid is one of the best in the Air Force. Enid's location is convenient to Oklahoma City, Tulsa, and Wichita, Kansas. Housing costs are reasonable with a typical three-bedroom, 2,000-square-foot house in above-average area running about $75,000. A restored historical building houses the Cherokee Strip Complex Center, a 37,000-square-foot complex of exhibit and meeting halls with on-site parking available for community use. Enid has 28 parks and recreation sites including Meadow Lake Park with a miniature train, amusement park for children, and an 18-hole public golf course. The climate permits enjoyment of outdoor activities. Skies are clear most of the time and winters are mild. There are 334 flying days a year and the average growing season is 266 days. The Enid Phillips Symphony Orchestra is the oldest symphony orchestra in Oklahoma and presents subscription concerts each year in the Briggs Auditorium at Phillips University. It also performs at numerous civic functions. Stage plays at the Gaslight Theater and Phillips University delight audiences. There is also the Grand National Quail Hunt, one of the country's major shooting events receiving national attention as film celebrities and prominent sports figures make annual visits to hunt with industrial leaders from throughout the world. We look forward to you and your family becoming a member of the Vance family. We hope you will enjoy your assignment and find this base video helpful as you prepare for your upcoming relocation.